What's going on guys, my name's Jack and today I've got a great video for you. It's an MP5 class setup on Modern Warfare Remastered. So, let's get straight into it. With the MP5, you only really have three choices with the attachment. You have the red dot sight, the silencer and the AGOG scope. Personally, I don't mind the iron sight, so I'm going to stick with that. And I'm going to silencer because for me, it feels like it reduces the recoil. And that is very beneficial as obviously you want to get more shots on target. With a sidearm, really you can pick any pistol. But personally, obviously I'm going to go with the Desert Eagle because nostalgia and it's powerful. And I just like the pistol in general, but honestly every pistol will do the job. For the tactical grenade, I went with the flash grenade because it blinds and you can barely see anything. And it's just really overpowered. And if you get flash, you're basically completely downed as useless because you can't kill anyone. So flashing the opponent is just simple, easy kill. For perk 1 I went with bandolier because the extra ammunition magazines come in really handy because if you're going on long streaks and you're killing lots of enemies then obviously you're going to need lots of ammo and the bandolier just gives you so much more ammo and it's just really really useful. In perk 2 there's so many different choices you could pick. I went with stopping power because it's more damage and the people who are using juggernaut kind of counteracts them. However, obviously there is Juggernaut you could use, you could use UAV Jammer so you're not getting constantly found because the UAVs are getting spammed. Sleight of hand reloading fast would be very beneficial because the reload speed isn't great. And obviously double tap because the rate of fire is not the highest in the class, but it's still really, really good. But rate of fire will just increase that. So that one's down to a personal choice. In perk 3, there's also like a variety of choices. I went with extreme conditioning so I can sprint for longer distances because obviously with an SMG you want to be moving fast, you want to go and find the people rushing. Uh, you could use steady aim which is the increased hip fight accuracy. Obviously if you're in close quarters combat you might not have time to end out sight so the hip fight accuracy could come in handy. Uh, last stand, uh, I've seen lots of people use that, I don't know really why, I wouldn't go with that personally because putting out a pistol before you die can often not really lead to a kill so it's kind of a pointless one. And obviously, dead silence is the key one when you unlock it because you make less how we move, so you can be moving quickly and no one will be able to find you, which is just really, really beneficial when you're using the SMG. Right, guys, so that is the class. I hope you enjoy it. I personally believe this is probably the best SMG class, and MP5 is probably the best gun in the SMG category. I hope you enjoyed the video. I'm going to leave you to watch the rest of the footage. I basically come back from major losing. Because uh, I joined in late and I ended up winning the game. So thank you for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. As I stand here totally crossed out. We can make jump, jump. Your boy Jam make ya. That's who I am and uh. Get with the plan, nigga. Just make sure that your hands up. I'm coming around the way, the way I'm coming around. You niggas be running around, thinking you running a town until that shit be tumbling down. The thunder and sound is rumbling now. You niggas had better be wondering how, cause lyrically I'm the shit. You couldn't get rid of me with the best plumber in town. Talking about dumbing it down, I never do that, cause that's too easy. Niggas be trying to diss, but they just dirt up in the